So hello Tesla Cats, this is Tesla Chan or Lucy if you prefer. So, welcome to my first ever gameplay. I apologize if you hear ticking in the background. Um, this is the little acre. Now, I know in my previous video that I put up here that um, I was asking if I want if you guys thought it would be cool if I changed it to a gameplay channel. I have changed my mind. I want to change it to a gameplay channel. Because it's just sitting around collecting dust, and at the current moment, I can't do much in terms of animations. Also, I did say you could leave suggestions down in the comments in the last video of what I should do or play. But, um, it's easier for me if I just play this. Because I already have it exist in existence on my computer. And I'm going to make sure you can hear me. There we go. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so, um... This is the Little Acre by Pewter Games. This is something my mom downloaded, as this is the family computer. We got it from the Mac store, and I don't remember how much it costs. But, uh, it's a cute little game. But, yeah, we're gonna just jump right into it. Um, I've played this once before, so if I go through this kind of quick, I apologize. I kind of forgot what happens in the game, but only kind of. So, here we go. New game. Let's move that away from there. Uh, I keep forgetting how cute these things are. Ah. Oh, and the animation is all done by the creators who did this at Pewter Games, so please support the official release of this game. I forgot to put on my glasses. Oh well, I'm, I'm fine. I'm good. I'm Gucci. <laughs> Oh, we lassie. I forgot what our connection is there. My apologies. I awoke to the sounds of Lily's gentle snores as we drifted across the ledge below. She was still fast asleep, but I needed to keep it that way, or suffer the consequences. Creaky floorboards meant that the simple act to get dressed would require a little ingenuity. <laughs> so, as you can tell, this is a point and click. So, I, I need to remember what's there. Oh. Alright, so I gotta wait. I forgot about that. Oh man. <laughs> I think you used that on the dog. Yeah, like I said, I've played this before, so I apologize if this feels really smooth. The game may as well grab that. Um, let's see, do I remember how to do this? Oh, there you go. Um, yeah, and here's the other cool thing about this, is you go to the notes. And you can get hints. We do go put it up again? Oh, that's right. There we go. That was my cue to sneak out of there. 
platter. I decided I'd cycle to the nearby town. Maybe I'd find someone willing to hire me. Maybe I'd find someone who knew where my dad had gone. But first, I had a few things to take care of. I completely forgot so much about this game. But, like, at the same time, I kind of know what's going on, which is a little sad, actually, but... I think you relocated so you won't be responsible for the weight of Lily. You and me both, buddy. <laughs> I was gonna leave while I still had things to do. <laughs> my trusty bicycle was my main method of transport. I definitely didn't require any modifications, despite what my father said. Taking into account Lily's willfulness, it was often easier to indulge her creativity than flat out ask her to do something. In this case, the gnome was a spy who informed me of when Lily wandered too far from the house. I think I might be doing this a little early. Dear Aiden, thank you for your application at the position of repair, of repair clerk at Boyle and Sons. I appreciate your consideration, but regretfully have to decide not to offer you a position at this time. While I have no doubt that someone with your military engineering experience would be capable of this role, more than capable for this role, I think you should you would be well suited for a more demanding occupation, perhaps an hydroelectric dam with a, your father. I wish you success in, in your future endeavors. Kindest regards, Sean Boyle, owner and manager. <laughs> Strange light. Yeah. Oh, it's a package from my father. Arthur. This is the last of the small crystals. I hope this was worth giving up your job for. I'm still finding the whole notion difficult to believe. I'm tempted to make a trip to your home to see it with my own eyes. But the fact that you keep the generator in your bedroom is quite unsettling, to say the least. If what you say about the lesser crystals is true, then I fear what may happen when this company begins experimenting on the large one. It's still safe for now, but I don't think it'll be possible to smuggle it out of here without anyone noticing. Given the apparent results of your own experiments, it's possible they'll listen to your warning. However, it's more likely they'll see nothing other than the potential for profit. For now, I'll do my best to impede their research. Stay safe, my friend. Nina. Strange crystals obviously belong to my father. I can't help but wonder if I have anything to do with going missing. I decided to do a little sleeping Cool. Alright, so. I think I went a little bit ahead of myself on that one. I apologize, guys. Um, <laughs> yeah. Lily's dress was hanging from the line. I didn't need to take it down for her. She developed her own technique for that. <laughs> Hoping utensils hung from the wall by the fire, for now at least. I'd recently made Lily a small wooden sword so she'd have something else to swing around. <laughs> if I went back up there, I'd wake Lily. I did not want to do that. Oh, <laughs> forgot how touchy this game is. <laughs> No, what I'm recording. It looked like he had rifled through his wallets in a hurry. Either that, or Lily had been searching for clues. Alright. 
Dad left his jacket behind. Sometimes his work would make him forget the little things, like wearing a jacket outside. Or eating. Don't fall away, okay. Let's click the button again, because I don't think we need it just yet. Dad made his own generator to power his workshop. As with his other inventions, he just refused to explain how it worked. It looked like there was something missing, but I hadn't figured out what. It looked like something important was supposed to go in the slot. If I remember correctly, it's this. Let's see. It fits. Huh? It's glowing. The label on the right indicated the weight of the crystal. Three pounds. And then five or four? Alright, let's see if I remember. gonna go back out. I'm doing things a little out of order because I remember so much but there's only but there's a certain order you have to do things in guys so yeah. I'm really quiet right now. I'm part the doors of the cupboard where we kept the dishes were tied closed. Bob Gooden did I'm pretty sure Lily Chu tried the last time. No I think you relocated so I'm pretty sure it was Dougal. You and me both buddy Garden. There's nothing really here as far as I know. I keep forgetting how be beautiful the visuals are for this thing. Right, I think I saw the jug back in the house, so I gotta go back in there. <laughs> so, I remember a lot about this game, don't get me wrong. I think... It might have been actually in here? Could be wrong. No, it's not in here. Um, where was it again? I think it, it might have been the kitchen, though. Because it was... Uh, that's right. <laughs> water jug. I picked up the jug. I need water to make Lily's breakfast. Cool. I'm pretty sure the mask we use on Dougal, but I forget when. So I'm just going to save it for now. this on the shed door though so. making sure I can take care of that now and I don't think you can see anything at the moment because of certain things I couldn't see a thing the idea of walking around a room in the dark or my father invented things it made me nervous <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, I was right, so I have to wait. So I want to get a couple other things done. Stump's going to be useful. But I need something else first, if I remember correctly. Wait. I don't still have it, so... Notes, please. What? I might have to do this on my own. Alright, we're gonna... Wait, there might have been something else in the house? I only ever saw the transmitter active on a few occasions. During those times, Dad would have kept the shed door locked tight. Okay. I hope I didn't just screw myself up because I know so much about this game and... And obviously that's her mother. Let's go to Arthur's room. I feel like there's something I should have grabbed. The rotor blades and Dad's transmitter were visible from his bedroom window. I do know. Let's do this. Oh yeah, that's right. That's why I need the water. Never mind. Um, back out. Looks like something. If I went back up there, I'd wake me up. But I did not want to do that. Cooking utensils hung from the wall by the fire, for now at least. I'd recently made Lily a small wooden sword, so she'd have something else to swing around. Was lying. I think you relocated so you won't be responsible for making Lily. You and me both, buddy. I can't remember if I did something wrong. I keep forgetting there are like, these cute little details that have nothing to do with the story. I'm sorry, guys. Um, how do I do this? Did I skip a step? I'm gonna use the mask on Doodle and see if. Okay, so I know at some point you're supposed to. Okay, so now you're behaving. Jeez. I'm sorry, guys. It was annoying me. <laughs> I just realized how little I talk. I think there's a switch on the wall too. I probably should have just flipped it. The lights in the shed only came on when Dad's generator was running. Oh! I figured I'd have it worked yet though. It wasn't your average generator. It looked like the pitchfork had fallen from its resting place. Alright. So now, uh, now I remember what to do. Now I remember. There's a solid block of wood next to the wall. Yeah, the mother 
impressive feat of engineering. Alright, yeah, so now the water, I think, goes in the machine. You see, I've played this game before, guys, so a lot of the stuff won't be news to me. But to you guys, it'll be like, what? So I apologize. <laughs> Alright, so I think the water... can't use it with the pot, because... That's not how this story progresses. <laughs> coolant. Back here. And I can't see all of it. That's it, man. Someone dad's inventions really were inspired. <laughs> there we go. Dad had a habit of writing on whatever was nearest at the time. Apparently he found a way to make sure I didn't clean it. He must have wanted to remember that particular pattern, but what for? Let's have you walk this way. I need to be able to see. Down. Okay, I think I got it. And I know that's something you plug into the machine, so... Might be the second one up. There we go. Whatever I did, it caused the machine in the back garden to power up. So I think the machine in the back garden is where I need to go next. Or the ah da 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 da. da. Yeah, it's turned on lights in the shed. It'll just give you the solution after you do that. Like, you have to click it a couple times, but... Yeah. Onward and yonward! <laughs> I don't know. I'm being weird. Don't mind me, guys. Right, so yeah. Let's see. There was a hand drawn map on the wall with two locations marked. Our house and the hydroelectric dam. Your dad used to work. Interesting. There was a large machine in the middle of the shed with what looked like sliding doors. Dad, you better not be stuck in there. <laughs> um, I don't remember if there's anything else in here that we need yet. Oh, that's right, you have to click up. I forgot how weird this game's mechanics are. Oh. Oh, there. Intended to respond to vibration, or that it was simply as reliable as the step ladder. <laughs> it was one of the puzzle boxes my father often made for Lily. I wasn't sure why he hadn't given her this one, but I knew she'd be happy to have it. Then doubt dance it out. And the machine appeared to be waiting for something. There's a small keyhole at the back. The 
like many of Dad's devices, its purpose was far from obvious. Alright, so I think now we have to go wake up Lily. Oh, I didn't want you to turn off the building. I wanted you to go back out in the garden, sweetie. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you go back out in the garden, sweetie? <laughs> onward and onward. Cow. I want to give Lily the puzzle box I found, but she was still asleep. Alright, now it'll work. Mm -hmm. So yeah, now Lily is a mechanic in the game. Ask again for a reason. I just forget what the reason is. <laughs> and all of you guys are like looking at it like, yeah, right, you you said you might not remember things. <laughs> I'm sorry I played this once. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, Tesla Cots. I have actually played this once. I wanna know. Dad converted the garden shed into his personal workshop when he decided he wanted to work for himself. He'd only spend every waking hour in there. Alright, so we're gonna go back in the shed. I'm pretty sure. Okay, I had the right idea. <laughs> I wasn't sure if there was. So hungry. Me breakfast. Look, Dougal, everything's laid out already. I should just make it myself. It's porridge. What could go wrong? Water? Check. Why doesn't Dad ever let me get a bowl for myself? Big old bag of oats. Prepare to be eaten. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. It's empty. <gasps> okay, I can fix this. All I need is a fresh bag of oats, a new bowl, and then to place a pot over the fire. <laughs> Dougal's amazing. This is easy peasy. What was Dad worried about? Oh, that's right. You can't ex- you. But I'm about to run out of time, ladies and gentlemen, so I'm gonna tune out. Thank you, Tesla Cat, so much for watching. As always- as always, remember to keep on keeping on, and I'll see you in the next one. Also, if you like this video, drop a like down below. It will mean a lot to me. 
Um, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.